Frozen's got to do it. Got to be the hero. Oh. And he can't find it. Getting this bomb down is going to be an issue right now. With that flank coming in slowly but surely. Daxter. Right? But it cannot be two times in a row now against B8 and these guys that it is fucking lucky against us. Um, welcome to Denmark. Hello, Mrs. Pins. Thank you. <laughs> um, I think we are a bit blessed that uh, we have so many different nationalities, which means that a lot of the countries we'll go to, we will have the whole field advantage. We will this time as well, because I'm Danish. <laughs> no, but uh, I'm really excited to be here at the RMR. I'm even more excited because uh, in this group of people, we have some of the best in the industry at what they do. On the server, off the server as well, around the team. And it's just exciting when you have a really good staff. In preparation for coming here, uh, we all agreed, and you don't know yet only, but that uh, the team will do it best every day to keep our good routines and good connections between each other. So staying on top of all the things we talked about and worked on over last years and we've developed. And this is what we want to have internally and showcase to other players and other teams. Pointy fingers, no recall, pistol. Mm. Perfect. How is he doing, Chris? Is he doing a good job? Mm, nah. No. No? Could be better. But what could he do better? Stand better. Yeah? Yes. Angles are all wrong. Lean your ass a little bit out. I can also do that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Touch on the veto. For tomorrow, because it's a little bit different than usual. It's an Iron Arm style veto. So it's a high seat, low seat. You choose to be team A or team B. Team A will remove two maps, team B remove three maps. Team A removes three the last two remaining. Yeah, we go for sides first. And then the, the other team, team B, chooses the side. We will be team B tomorrow. And this means that they'll ban two maps. I assume it will be all pass Inferno. We will then ban three maps. After talking to Chris Consulting, we will leave in Anubis today. This means that they'll pick between Mirage or Ancient tomorrow. If they go by what they're good at, they will play Ancient. And if they feel like they have to pull an offset or whatever, they'll, they'll be in the rush. Ancient as our first map of the day here on the B stream, and it's of course going to be Bait taking on Mouse. You already know. Yeah, wasting no time on this one. Bait setting up outside of B. Zershin is giving it a little look at. Oh, okay. That's a nice way to open. And this double bait and switch with a quad B lean out of Mouse. Oh, oh, and they might never even learn about the double bait over in Cave. Okay, well, with Zershin looking this good out of the gate. Mao's get a lot more scary. He is burning Ooh. alive. He's super low on health, but he's got so many teammates here to fill the hole. He's uh, he's gonna be all right. Oh no! Oh, taking matters into his own hands. I love this. Trying to be the difference maker, dude. I, I do like yeah. the brain on this guy. I like the way he plays. Look at it all the way through spawn. He's got these rotates locked down. This is a real power position, oh, but he won't get out with a kill. That. Frozen checks deep. Plant might be the best that Bait can manage. They're going to plug in the numbers, but already the Mao's boys are moving in for the retake. Ooh, flank from Temple is good. Kirka won't wait, but he also can't hit his shots. Frozen finds three to finish, and Mao's a full house. Zershan going to try and clear the corner. He does. Owner low. Second player. He thinks it's a and bait. he flicks back. Yeah, they think it's a B stack, but meanwhile, coming back Ooh. through spawn is Captain Kirka with a Deagle. Dropping the bomb. Time running low. Missed Orb shot. Jumping MP9. This round is madness. This is this is starting to get out of hand, man. The backstab. Frozen! Oh. The lineup is in. Got a man already in the sight. 
lurking in the back lines. Amster has the round in the palm of his hand. Now I think they've slipped the net, that they found this timing. And with Captain Kirk making noise out through the CT push, that might make this backstab through main. Even less of a known quantity. Bomb gets away from Mouse. The round starting to fall apart. Frozen's got to do it. Got to be the hero. Oh. And he can't find it. Bait pick up an upset win to open up this game. And for Mouse, heartbreak sets in. For the other side, it's elation. What a way to open up. Oh, <laughs> First off, Sergeant B, please. On the match that happened. And then we'll talk about what's next in the next few hours and how we're going to prepare for South. You guys all see right now that most of the favorites are also struggling. It was not just us. I'll be honest, in the game we just played, to me it felt like they were very hungry and they were just playing to win and they had no fear at all. The rounds where we got entries, they would just push up banana again, push out A. They would just do whatever, like full confidence all the time. That's something you have to be aware of in every game. That people can play aggressive, they play with balls, no fear. Right? Just being on your toes. Another thing we can adjust right now is that the team play has to be much better cross map. And we understand as a team constantly you know, what's going on in the round. What does it require? How do we win the round? So that we see past just our own crosshair and we're helping each other. That's, that's what's very important for me. Es geht, Mann. Alles klar? Hallo. Wie geht's? Gut? Ja? Ja, normal. Bist du hyped? Ich bin sehr hyped. Nice. Gute Talks, gute Gespräche. Bisschen für die deutschen Leute, ne? Natürlich, ja. der Untertitel da dabei, hoffe ich. Mal Aber gucken. Mal gucken. Du willst nicht reinschneiden. Das ist toxic. Ich schneide dran, aber ich weiß nicht, ob ich Untertitel mache. Ah, okay. Soll okay. ich Untertitel machen? Weiß ich nicht. Für die englischen Leute natürlich. Inkludiert. Ne? Aber ich bin halt, wir hatten gute Conclusions, gute Talks von dem Los. Und äh, ja, wird nice. Jetzt wird rasiert? Jetzt wird rasiert. Nice. Close and that puts his crosshair off. JDC can't trade for more than one. This is getting dicey. Dex is getting chased as well on the B bomb site. Story somehow has control of default. So have B, but they don't need to end here. They have so much attention. The orb finds him. Now they've got to go donut. Oh no. You're being funneled straight into the awaiting jaws of Frozen as well. Lurking towards the back. Oh. He's got the timing to wow. stab them all one by one. Slices them to bits and secures the 14th. Maz do clear mid. There's that late luck, but he's not coming in. He's bringing the bomb very late here. Right now, it's yeah. sore in the gutter. If anything, the fact that the bomb's so late is what makes this awkward. This really throws you through. Oh! oh! Suddenly, from nowhere, Story is looking to make it happen. A collateral into the donut. Dead from the temple. Wrap round just only just yes. arrives. Oh. And he will oh. get knocked on out. Maz with the win at 16-12. They walk that one over the line. They Make it to the other side, <laughs> Nice, good job. Yeah. Good job. They, they fucking, uh, good job. 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 Good than the loss, of course. Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. So this is nice. <laughs> That's super. I can go to sleep. I can go to sleep with that. <laughs> I can go to sleep. I don't have a... a I mean, you know what? I spent enough time with Dennis in the room. Yeah. Wait, wait. Cheers. <laughs> okay, but, um, he is the group. He's today, the group. a little bit of a tight schedule because it's a morning game, right? Mm -hmm. As we agreed yesterday, we got to put all of our energy into this one game. Yeah. That's all we have today. Mm -hmm. That's why we're a little bit early up, that's why we do a little bit early preparation. Or is just going to start us off with a little expedition, then we talk first. And after you guys can talk and change the DM while you think about the things we just talked about.
Heute ist, los, heute, ist, heute ist nicht dein Tag. Ich weiß nicht, so bist du aufgeregt. Du bist zittrig. How's he doing? He's doing good. He's ready to play, you know? Yeah. Okay, maybe we're not with the old but Some clicks. definitely the favorites coming into the Falcons. We all want to see it happen. Absolutely. But I think this matchup could be tough. I really feel as though Falcons are at their best when there's a bit of chaos injected in there. They seem to be able to stay pretty calm in those scenarios. Mao's are so good at just playing fundamental, basic Counter-Strike, keeping it simple. I feel like that might be too much for Falcons. Mouse! This. We've got MBK up on close. Flash. He wants to take the fight. The flash through, but frozen. He manages to find one. Torch with another. Kenny S getting up close with the Glock. Gets one back. A bit of damage on the fallback. But they are playing a player down. Still one more flash on Dexter to set up a peak. And Python just taking one. Body with another. JDC does get something back. And now he has to find two more. And he finds the first. Oh, JDC, what a shot! JDC is so good in pistol rounds. I see this guy popping off in pistols all the time. MBK going dry, hits the first headshot. Oh, what a transfer from MBK. And now Dexter is so low on health. Where does the bomb go here? Because Python is still so far away, but I think he might just plant the CT. Yes, yeah, the right read, right play. Smoking towards short. No one can swing out from there to deny this. And MBK actually faking it, playing with a bit of the clock oh. here. Has to go for the commitment. It's going to make this go. Oh, look at MBK go. A one-man wrecking machine. And finally, he falls. But Python there to refrag immediately. Dexter finds one back. Masuta now taking the place of Kenny. And Dexter's found another. Frozen, removing Masuta. The body now on that flank, finally activating. And time is a huge issue. Yeah, getting this bomb down is going to be an issue right now. With that flank coming in slowly but surely, Dexter spotted out, and that is it. Falcons take a dominant win over Mouse. In the gun rounds especially, they were fantastic today. Body ends on 27 kills, but honestly, all the riflers played their part, and that is a massive win for Falcons. The fairy tale continues for the French roster now. 2-1 here at the Paris Major RMR. In the game, there's many times you get killed, and like, ah, oh, it's a good timing by him, you know, I played it well. I oh, mean, he had a sick shot. It's maybe true in the situ situation. Okay, three times, whatever happens. I think you do the right thing by saying that happened, so we move on instantly. Right? But it cannot be two times in a row now against B8 and these guys that they just fucking lucky against us. No, I mean, even if you lose entry, it doesn't mean the round is lost, right? That's also true. I mean, other teams also lose entry and they still win for fucking 4 So yeah. And the, the guy that dies is instantly like, ah, fuck man, you know, I can do this with a teammate to make up the round because he wants to win. He's not thinking about his stats or that he died in a stupid way. He wants to win and he sees what kind of round can he play out if you talk to his team. He wants to win. You guys are really fucking good when you want to be good. And you can play some beautiful Counter-Strike fundamentally. And so, but it's not going to be about that here. It's going to be about who wants to win more. We can easily do it. It's going to be tough, but we will do it. And we just got to bring the attitude that we want to win. If there's anything you can do more for the team, or you would like to adjust, or anything like that, Think about it over the next few hours. But from my perspective, 
it's more of an attitude thing on the server going into the game and through the rounds constantly having this I want to fucking win. Bringing him down low, stay yeah! alive!